internet friends, welcome to another episode of the Synergy Cafe online show featuring speaker, entertainer, close-up illusionist, and marketing alchemist, Magic Brad. It's the internet lifestyle show about career, finance, relationships, spirituality, and wellness. We're moving the online chatter over to real life activity. And now, please welcome your host of Synergy Cafe, Magic Brad. Hey, Internet friends, this is Magic Brad, Synergy Cafe and the Synergy Collaborative, and I've got a new friend on the line, and his name is Peter, and I think he's from the East Coast. Is that right, Peter? Yes, sir. Hey. So, yeah, that's kind of the East Coast, Atlanta. I lived in Asheville, North Carolina for a while, and you're like, what, three, four hours away from Asheville? Isn't that amazing? We went there, but I've never seen all of it. That's huge. That's a big piece of real estate, and you're in the real estate business. <laughs> Is that why you're over there? You're checking it out because you might sell it? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I understand. So how long you lived in Atlanta? About Oh, pretty stable. I've been in Minneapolis for... Basically 60, other than a couple of years in Asheville. Not in Asheville, Asheville. Exactly, exactly. So you're married and got kids? Married, got three kids, 17, 15, 16-year-old. Oh, are they all boys? Okay, <laughs> so you got a little mix. You know how to work both the energies there. So you're involved in real estate investing, and like I mentioned, that's always intriguing to me because they have a different kind of mindset than the uh, transaction type mentality where you just give somebody some money and you get something. Real estate investing takes some time for things to nurture, right? Are you flipping? Is that what you're doing? Or? I do is somewhere between 40 to 50 deals on a weekly basis. So I am treating real estate as a transaction and uh, getting in and getting out very quickly. I'm kind of a, I'm a more of a short-term player when it comes to, to investing. Got it. So how long have you been doing that? Boy, probably about 15 years. I used to be in a mobile home business and then uh, that changed overnight. And so I got in the real estate business uh, pretty much right afterwards. Well, you're pretty stable, it sounds like. I, as an entrepreneur, I started doing magic when I was a little kid and then working on some other stuff. I got into making jewelry and I used to do some event production and stuff. And now I'm doing internet marketing and all that kind of thing. So you got some stability going on, which is two thumbs up. There you go. <laughs> yeah, no, in business, as you know, it could be here today, gone tomorrow. So we've been fortunate. You know, we have a model that's working, working well. It's a pretty disruptive model. So, you know, there's, there's I see nothing but huge upside for what we're doing right now. Do you teach other people how to do what you're doing, or do you just do what you do yourself? No, I do. I actually have a consulting slash coaching program. People can find me on the, on the web, and uh, um, I work with people actually many times, me personally, uh, one on one, and you know help them develop pretty dynamic businesses. How do how do they find out about that? I'm assuming you got a web domain or something. That... Yeah, yeah, they can just go to www.coachingbypeter.com, coachingbypeter.com, and they'll see little blurb about me, by me, and, and for me, and, and then if they, they, they like what they hear, they can put their information in and I'll actually touch base with them. That's perfect. I like domains like that. I use Magic Brad, and then I've got Follow Magic Brad. It's uh, it's good to have a, a domain yep. that's easy to remember rather than if, like, if it was your name, I suppose. I don't know how you, I don't know how to pronounce your name. It's Vel, what, what is it? It's uh, Vexelman. Vexelman. Yeah, people would never go to it then. <laughs> exactly. Mm. So do you have any, like, coaching programs coming up or do you just do one-on-ones or how do you do that? No, I do one-on-ones, you know, as people find out about me and you know, they're curious about me, maybe hearing some, an interview that, like, that you're doing with me or I mean, they've been thinking about getting into real estate investing. Maybe they already are in a business and they're just looking to move up the food chain. And, you know, they find out about me, they get a hold of me. I, I check them out, they check me out and for a good fit personality wise, then, um, then we start working together. Matter of fact, a lot of my coaching, they're, it's interesting. The reason I got into coaching was a way to create partners. So an overwhelming majority out of the 50 deals I do on a weekly basis, probably about 
30 to 40 of them consistently are with my past clients that become successful. And then we actually start partnering and doing deals across the United States together. Oh, that's really smart. That's kind of like what I've got going on with this synergy collaborative kind of thing. It's people working mm -hmm. together instead of competing. And that's what you're doing. It uh, sounds like it can expand and, and uh, working with groups of people. You can start like an investor co-op if you wanted to probably. Yep. Mm -hmm. Cool. Yep. yep. And, and like I said, I, I have a really good network of past clients. A lot of my clients become real life big time partners. You know, they, for instance, out of my Jacksonville office, you know, my, 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 we used, Pete used to be my coaching client. Now he's a partner. He owns a 8,000 square foot building, which is his office. He's got 10, 15 employees that come as a result of working together. And, and just he and I alone probably do about 20 deals on a monthly basis. Plus we wow. have a regular retail outfit of real estate agents that have collectively well, over 100 listings. That's really cool. Like, like you're showing yourself right now. And I know that you're a real person and you're willing to say that you're from Atlanta because some of these things, these real infesting um, seminars and stuff, they come and they fly into town and they do their deal. They sell their $3,000 program, then they fly away and you don't know who the hell they are. So it's kind of nice knowing. Yeah, it's the guru world. You know, this, what I tell, you know, this is what I tell people. If you want to just learn about the business, that's fine. You can go to every seminar, you can go to a webinar. I mean, the, you and I both know the trick, the, 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 the dirty secret is you can go on the internet now and get all that for free. What? Um, but but <laughs> if you want to get from learning something to actually implementing and making money, you have to have somebody there like myself. you got to totally have somebody agree. on a daily basis that knows how to react and act in a specific situation. So that's why I tell people if you want to make money, you got to work with a mentor or coach. That's what I tell people too, because oftentimes there's things about yourself that you cannot see in the mirror. You don't understand it, even mm -hmm. though you do all the research. Your coach sometimes needs to tell you that, you know, maybe you should be wearing a tie or maybe you shouldn't be wearing a tie or getting some input from a person when you go and do some of that business. You got kind of thing. it. You got it. Got it. So um, you've already told us um, how to get a hold of you. And why don't you repeat that again in case someone didn't hear it? It's Sure. They just go to my website, www.coachingby.com peter.com and they could uh check me out there perfect and then here's my favorite question and then i'll sign this one off and we'll what i do is with these is i put them up to youtube and they take that embed code and i put it on blogs and i take the blogs and propagate them out to social media and hashtag and keyword and all that kind of stuff so if you see this okay. stuff online if you can like and comment and share it and sure what rising tide lifts all boats kind of thing but i like it Here's my favorite question. This is the big why question. You've been doing this for a long time, but why are you doing this real estate thing? Why aren't you like a softball coach or a, a mountain climber or something? Well, I, I wouldn't be a good softball coach and I'd probably kill myself climbing mountains. Okay. Um, but, but you know, we, we have a very unique model. I've actually combined a traditional real estate investment company with a traditional retail brokerage. And that's how we go to the market. There's really no one in the country that does what I do at this high level. So I'm, I'm a, I like to consider myself to be very disruptive to the marketplace. I mean, we, we are actually making an impact in this industry. We're just not another investor. I'm not just another real estate agent. You know, we're, what we're doing is, is, is making a huge impact at the consumer level, at the corporate level for brokerages and all that. So why do I do it? You know, we're, we're making a difference. We're really making a difference. I think you will see in the next four to five years, this type of a model will be the most prevalent way people will be conducting real estate. So it, 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 I make I make a difference out there. It's That's cool. uh, good to hear. And I'm telling you, 99.9% .9 of the people I ask the big why question to, it's for wanting to help other people. So it's, there's, again, there's hope for humanity. That's what I always there you say. Go. It's very cool. There you go. Well, let me uh, pop this thing up here. And then um, if you see me on the internet somewhere, you can go to Follow Magic Brad. And I spend a lot of time on Facebook because I got multiple pages there that are related to okay. the five pillars of career, finance, relationships, spirituality, and wellness. And that's all with the Synergy Collaborative. And then we can... Okay. We can... Uh, Co co promote. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, friendly on my Facebook page. Okie doke. Thanks, Peter. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you. Be well.